okay just some thoughts about Facebook page promotion uh, using other social networks right now if, if you've got a uh, Facebook page obviously you want to build up the number of people who, who like it and get your uh, get your updates right so uh, a very good long-term strategy for this is to connect with other Facebook page owners right in your niche obviously um, and when you do that you want to start on a good note right you want to you want to get on their radar um, make a good impression uh, stand out from the pack uh, which is why I, I wouldn't do what a lot of people do uh, which is they like the other Facebook page as their page and then they um, start posting uh, you know ads for themselves on the stream you know they sort of they just sort of like planting a, an ad on on someone else's uh, real estate you know it's sort of and it's, that, that'll often annoy that the page owner or even if it doesn't annoy them then you know it's sort of still not making a good impression and you're not you're not standing out because so many people do that so uh, you want to get on their their radar in a good way so here's a way of doing that using another social network uh, now to explain the concept uh, I'll, I'll I'll describe what I I did with uh, my Pinterest boards uh, to to help me build up my Facebook uh, connections right so uh, and this is what I did in Perth I have done it in Sydney a bit but I did it quite often when I was in Perth so so what I did was I built all these Pinterest boards uh, pin boards for um, uh, various business niches in Perth such as you know uh, Perth cafes Perth restaurants Perth IT companies Perth locksmiths whatever you know uh, a whole bunch of boards right and then I um, pinned images from the websites uh, for those uh, for those companies right and I put them in the relevant boards and then I found those pages for those companies for those websites on Facebook because they were almost all of them now any any business with any sense it's got a Facebook page right so um, I found those Facebook pages connected with it you know like them as my Facebook page and, and then I engaged with their posts uh, with their updates you know uh, like them uh, uh, commented etc to get on their radar a bit anyway and then um, after a little while I uh, um, wrote a uh, an update to their wall or you know to their main stream um, which then ends, ends up going down to the bottom right hand of the of the Facebook uh, uh, screen right um, which was just basically informing them that I'd included uh, their business in my Pinterest board for that category so it, it would be something like oh uh, just to note to say I've I've uh, uh, you, I've put your business in my uh, uh, pin Pinterest board for Perth cafes, for example, and um, it was really interesting uh, the, the the response I got. You know, it was uh, did, they didn't always respond, but um, quite a, quite often, you know, I would get oh yeah, they would like the post. Sometimes they'd even share it to their main stream, right? Which was really good because I'd get a couple of likes to my page that way. Um, and sometimes I'd get uh, likes to my page uh, from the from those page owners, um, either as their page or as themselves, <laughs> right? Um, so you know, it clearly it, it clearly uh, worked as a strategy to make a good impression, and because they realised that you know I was helping them, uh, how much uh, you know if that's debatable. Um, uh, I certainly wasn't harming them. I wasn't ripping off their content or anything like. Very occasionally, some people might think that if you pin a uh, uh, an image from a website to a Pinterest board, that somehow you're stealing that image. But you're not. You're just giving them a backlink um, from that uh, uh, Pinterest board. Uh, I don't think it really helps with SEO, but uh, it certainly uh, puts them. Uh, will, will eventually get them some clicks coming back uh, as a result of being included on that uh, pin board. Right, so it it definitely helps them, and, and, and most people, they well, the vast majority of people, realise that they appreciate it, um, and 
you know, it's just that was just a very good way of of making a good first impression. Now you could use that technique, or you could uh, make a variation of, of of it on another social network, maybe LinkedIn or Instagram or whatever. I you know, you could get creative with with it, but but it's just a, a, an example of using different social networks uh, to uh, make good connections with other Facebook page owners uh, and I've tried it and I will use it again uh, and please use it yourselves. Thanks very much for watching.